Hi, this is Yuan Bo. I'm introducing the paper, Efficient Algorithms for Dynamic Bidirectic Diagrammability. This is a joint work with Chris Satya and Professor Chiyun Zhang from Georgia Tech. In modern software development, it is common that we want certain analysis up to date with code changes. For example, in the following program, suppose we want to have a static analysis to decide whether the variable A and variable E can refer to the same memory location. The typical treatment for this alias analysis is to formulate it as a bidirectional diagnostic problem. The analysis ex extracts a bidirectional graph from the given program. In this reachability graph, nodes represent variables and edges represent value flows in the original programs. The open parentheses edge in labels uh, represent the field axes, and the closed parentheses represent the field assignments. The question of whether the variable A and variable E are aliases becomes whether there exists a dike pass between node A and node E. A pass is a dike pass if the edge labels along the pass form a word in the dike language. The dike language has the following grammar, which represents a set of all matched parentheses strings. Before we make any changes to the code, there exist two dike passes from node A to node E in the graph. One goes from node A to B to C to D, and finally to node E. The other dike pass goes from node A to F, node X, then to node E. The analysis shows that the two variables can be aliases to each other. However, we want to keep the analysis results up to date with code changes. Suppose we delete these two lines of code in the program, the program graph will be updated correspondingly. The analysis needs to update needs the updated result for the binary diagnostability. In fact, the two variables are no longer aliases to each other because there exists a no diagnosis between node A and node E in this updated graph. Instead of recomputing the binary diagnostability result from scratch, it is more efficient to have a dynamic algorithm which can exploit the previous diagnostability result and maintain it over edge insertions and deletions in the graphs. The bidirectic formulation is an important variant of diagrammability. The bidirectic edge is a prerequisite for the formulation of alias analysis. The bidirectic variant can also serve as a relaxation for diagrammability to obtain better performance. Different approaches to compute the bidirectic diagrammability from scratch have been proposed. A graph with n nodes and m edges, its optimal algorithm has been shown to have an OM complexity. The optimal static algorithm has a linear runtime and can be used as a naive approach to recompute the diagrammability for dynamic edge updates. Thus, it is challenging to design a dynamic algorithm which is better than the static algorithms in both theoretical running time and in practice. In this work, our contribution is to fill in this gap and propose the dynamic algorithms for bidirectional diagrammability. The proposed algorithms have a asymptotically fast running time than the static version. In comparison with the OM complexity using the naive approach, it has a ON running time for edge insertions and ON alpha n running time for edge deletions, where the alpha is the inverse argument function, which can be regarded as a constant in practice. In addition, our algorithms have no redundant computation for maintaining the diagrammability results. Our experiments also show that the proposed algorithms are very efficient in practice. The proposed algorithm achieves two magnitudes of speed up than the naive approach. We also implement the diagrammability in data log and compare our algorithm with the state of the art data log software with incremental support. Our algorithm is more than 10 times faster than the data log software in terms of the absolute running time. In addition, we compare the speed up of our proposed algorithm over naive update and the speed up of the incremental data log software over its naive update approach. The proposed algorithm achieves a more than two times more speed up than the incremental data log solver. If you are curious about the topic, please come to our presentation during the conference for more details. Thank you.